Hello everyone, welcome back to Glow Up Refresh. Today's video is going to be my most complimented fragrances of 2022 thus far. Um, I'm giving you all my most complimented fragrances as in from an inexpensive to expensive uh, perfumes that I'm going to share with you guys. I've been getting so many compliments on fragrances and I never was a fragrance girl until about maybe a year ago. So I just started my collection and my collection is growing and it's pretty nice so far and I'm, I'm loving the the fragrance collection that I have so far but I want to let you guys in on the secrets of my most complimented fragrances that people just compliment me on and I just feel so good when they compliment me on don't you feel so good when somebody say you smell good like that is like top-notch compliment in my book like oh my god I smell good thank you <laughs> let's get right into I'm going to start with the inexpensive perfume first and this is Kim Kardashian's nude sand now I know she like went out of business and now everything is super duper expensive if you want to get a hold of these because they're like not available anymore and me when she went out of business but she was having the going out um, business thing they were still expensive as heck but I grabbed like three bottles of these and these smell so good this is nude sand this is my favorite I always get complimented on this when I wear it so I did take some notes if you see me catching looking down at my notes I took some notes in my little notepad on my phone so I can give you guys the exact key notes of how this smell so it's very floral woody and a little hint of musk now you girls know that I do not like musk unless it's like totally hidden and this gives a little tiny hint of musk to me also this scent is very rose i feel like it's amber ambery rose type of feeling and you girls know that i love my floral scents because i love fresh and light scented and it gives you a bit of like roasted velvet they said hmm i like that roasted velvet i could totally smell that and it just gives rich like rich without without the richness <laughs> it just gives rich it gives quality and it's long lasting so Kim Kardashian did her thing I don't know what she's going to do with her other fragrances I think she's gonna do a whole new fragrance line hopefully it will be as good as these. now I have Moschino fresh and I hope I'm saying the name right but this has got me a lot of compliments this has got me more compliments than the pink one that I wear. I wear this when I'm fresh out the shower and just want to spray it all over on a regular day and I'm not going anywhere special. And look how cute this bottle is. It's like a freaking Windex bottle. It's so freaking cute. No, you can't spray it like this. I, I wish you could spray it like that because that would be even more cuter. But this is how it is. It's so dope and cute and I will put the link down below if you ladies are interested. And like I said, this gives you a very clean, fresh smell. And let me read from my notes that I found. Alright, so this is Fruity Notes, Lily in the Valley, Pink, Grapefruit, and Black Cherry. Um, notes, Winter Sweetness, Rose, and Pomegranate. Okay, so this is it. This is exactly what it says. It's fruity, it's floral, it's light scented, it's everything that I love in a perfume. This is long lasting and it is fresh. It, it's the name. It lives up to its name. It's very fresh. It gives you that fresh straight out of the shower. Hey, I'm here. And it's long lasting. Go out on a date. So regular outings, outings every day. Like this is just perfect everyday scent, I feel like. You can definitely wear this every freaking day. now i'm going to go into the little of little bit of pricey perfumes so this is gucci blue this fragrance is amazing and i love the cute pink bottle mm, it's just giving fresh floral bouquet of flowers it's giving so flower like it's it smells like a bouquet it smells like a bouquet of flowers like it's it's definitely a floral scent it's definitely a floral scent it's definitely long lasting um i apply this with my vanilla oil so i put my vanilla oil on first and then i apply this to the areas you know 
and I apply this to the areas that needed to be applied to as a perfume, there's certain points on your body that will let the smell increase through the day. And I've learned that when I did my research. And let me read you guys the notes so I won't get it confused. Alright, so this is a white floral scent, I told you. This is giving rich girl, honey. If you want to smell like a rich, successful girl, baby. This is giving a rich girl. Um, it smells like a florally edge. It says honeysuckle, jasmine, natural feeling of flowers. Like I said, creamy, creamy floral, blooming, you know, summer. It's giving summer. Well, I purchased this scent because of the girls on TikTok, honey. Luxury black girl TikTok is so me and I love watching it and I feel inspired to go buy things of course why not um this is Burberry Her this is so cute um it's giving it's giving fruits it's giving fresh fruits as you girls know um I'm a fresh fruity girl like I said I'm a fresh clean scented light fragrance girl and this is giving a lot of fruits I've got so many compliments on this I wore this for my birthday and I wore this for my sister's birthday um, when we went out for her birthday and I got so many compliments on this perfume and as you can see I only wear it when I'm going out <laughs> so this is like my going out type scent like yes I'm going out to the girlies and that's it. I go out with it. I go to dinner with it. Wherever I want to go that's special. When I get a little bit dressed up with the heels on, this is when I wear Burberry Hair. Let me tell you guys what it really smells like. So, fruity floral, like I said. Raspberry, cherry, strawberry, blackberry, blueberry, violet, jasmine, wood, and a hint of musk and amber. I do not smell the musk in this, but if they say so, I guess it's here. Um... But this is giving, and it's definitely long-lasting. I usually put this on, like I said, when I'm just going out. I don't put it on every day. I don't feel like it's an everyday scent because it's giving a little bit of giving. You know, a little bit of more summer than you want to. So this is definitely for when you go out and have a good time and you just want to get complimented on. Okay, this is my girl right here. I'm introducing my girl right here. Like, she's been with me throughout, through thick and thin. And I am never giving up on her. Okay, this is my everyday scent if I want it to be. You understand? Before I got into perfumes, this was my favorite perfume in the world still my favorite perfume I always get complimented on this when I go to birthday parties when I go everywhere I go I people tell me that I smell like a fresh scent of flowers so Versace bright crystals Versace bright crystals this girl right here is amazing like she did so much for me <laughs> throughout my life as you can see I had the biggest bottle there is I do have the travel size as well um i finish her like there is no other because this is just like literally my to-go scent um when i go out like literally i just throw if i don't want to smell like anything else i will put my versace break crystals on and this is never disappointing ladies never disappointing i'm telling you but it all depends on your sense and what do good for you because certain scents does not smell good on me um i tried another versace out and it did not just it did not it wasn't giving uh, a lot of the tom ford i gave away my um tom ford peach to my sister because my sense was not hitting it just smelled really disgusting on me i don't want to say that but it smelled funky on me and it was weird and on my sister it smelled great so just what goes with your chemicals as well but i would say try it out and give it a shot I sometimes I blind shop with perfume but usually I like to go in Sephora and Macy's and Nordstrom's and see exactly and smell not see smell exactly what I'm giving but sometimes when I'm going there it's like listen I get a headache because I smell all those doggone perfumes and this is too much let's get right into the fragrances so it says fresh refreshing chilled Soothing blossoms of magnolia, lotus flower, warm with notes of musk and amber. Definitely, I feel like it's described perfect. Mm, it just smells so good. I don't even know how to describe it. It doesn't smell like old lady. I hate perfumes that smell like old lady. And I feel like, what was the other one that I hate? Flower bomb. I don't know. It's just, maybe it's the musk. I got. I had flower bomb. I gave it to my mom. I'm like, 
why is this so hype? Why is everybody so hype about this? And I feel like Baccarat probably smells like old lady too. Musky old woman. And I don't want to smell like an old woman. I have not smelled it yet, but I'm going to like try to smell it. Mm, I feel like it's not giving too much for me. But this is giving so much goodness. I already sprayed my perfume once. I don't want to mix it, but I will spray it if I want to. Hmm. It just smells like you're just in a great place. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. And the winner is most complimented ever in 2022 for me is Valentino. This little baby right here gets the crown. It gets the freaking medal of the year. It gets everything that you need is literally in this bottle. And you know what? It is a hint of musk in this. I know it for a fact because I smell it. But ladies, I'm, I'm telling you, I think I told the story in my other video of my favorites, but I was sitting at the bar with my sister and the lady, the bartender, literally was like, who smells that good? And I'm like, is it me? Because I just sprayed this one. She was like, is that Valentina? And I'm like, yes, Valentina. She was like, I need to get me another bottle because I smell you over here and it is giving life. And that made me was like, and my sister was like, she was like, I told you you smell good, girl. And I'm like, you did say that. You did say that. So let's get right into what it really smells like. Let's read the notes. So it's giving, this is actually Valentino born in Roma. I want you to know this because I bought a regular Valentino and it doesn't smell like this. So um, the top notes are black currant, pink pepper. The middle notes are jasmine, uh, jasmine tea. The base notes are vanilla, cashmere, and wood. So I can definitely smell the cashmere in this, I can definitely smell the jasmine, and I can definitely smell the vanilla. Um, I do not smell wood that far, but I told you it's a little bit musky than I normally wear. Um, but this musk is actually giving something. Like most musk are funky, and this musk are actually giving me everything I need to be given. This is my to-go summer for perfume, and I feel like I could wear this in fall as well. Thank you girls and guys for watching and let me know if you like this video and what's your favorite perfume. Put it down below. All the links will be down below for you. Please subscribe and thumbs up this video.